These uh, 305s are 18 feet wide, 25 feet long. So these are the big Bama Jamas. That's a 303 sitting over there. That's 18 by 15. That one, the 203, is 15 by 14. So that's the two series is, is the 14 wide. All right, folks, we got uh, 305J. That's Juliet. This is one of the nicest ones here. There we go. It's got the nice, uh, different, newer looking label than some of the newer, some of the other ones. Um, all right. On the outside, everything looks really nice. It's got the corner. Let's check and see how many they have. There's a corner row, a really nice end wall. Another corner row. This uh, side with the porch for the heating and air. Two doors, three windows. Another end wall. Okay, we got the rope there. I forgot to look at these. There's one. There's one. All right, so there's not a rope here or here. And wall looks pretty nice also. And a rope on this corner. Ports, windows, doors, no rope, 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 no rope. All right, there's the status on the outside. I didn't see any holes anywhere on the outside. I'm walk around. Before. Let me turn the light off so we can see light shining through if there are holes. I'm not seeing any here. Okay, turn the light back on. This is a regular 305, not a stovepipe, so there's no hole in the roof for stovepipe to pass through. On the windows, the most common thing we see on the windows is the Velcro pulling away. That Velcro looks intact on the roof. You can see the, the, how the clear window looks on these. Not too shabby. The Velcro is in place. Velcro is good. All right, all of the support wires and poles appear to be in pretty good shape here. So here again, we don't go over every single centimeter. Oh, that's the closest thing to a rip we've got, isn't it? Just a little abraded area. It even goes through, I think it's just the, the tan from the other side showing. Um, yeah, we, we are checking for structural issues. I don't think we had to replace anything on this, but sometimes like the little yellow hubs have to get replaced or a wire needs replaced or something. Um, that's what we're doing. This, this might be the nicest one yet, to be completely honest. We're gonna call this 305 Juliet. If you'd like to take Juliet home and have your way with her, please let me know. You can find details on gearreport.com. Search when you get there for HPT Base X tents for sale. Let us know if you have any questions in the comments. A big thanks to our patrons for helping us bring you more unbiased, hands-on reviews. Thank you very much, and we'll see you at the range. Thank you.